Welcome back to Kerbal Hard and Uncut, and we are around Moho. We're trying to capture right now. We're doing a little bit of transmitting of science while we go. But uh, yeah, we are very much aware of the fact that we're about to run out of fuel on that stage. We're going to fire that one off, and we've just got our lander now. So this is the lander. Um, it doesn't have any landing legs, and it has a... Oh, it's got a solar panel on the bottom. Oh, now that's clever. Now, was that able... To, I'm guessing that wasn't able to find power when it was... Is that in case we land upside down? I don't know. Maybe maybe that is the case. Maybe that's the design. I don't know. Right. So we're we're actually we're actually we're in orbit now. Um, we can we can basically do whatever we want with this. Uh, we're going to pull it down a bit. I'm um, I'm not too worried about how far we go down. That's good enough for me. Right. We're going to leave that where it is for now. Slow down the time a little bit. We've got about three hours until the next arrival. So the first one is this. Now I'm going to capture the next one. And then we're going to see about landings. I also need to decide about science from sort of on the way down. Um, this has got two pods. That's really nice. We've got one from high. Uh, what's our science looking like after that? Yes, that gives us a big bump. Um, we've got something else for a milestone. What's this? We have uh, we gathered first science from Moho. Good. We've entered the orbit of Moho. Good. We got a, a reasonable amount of money for that, but not not a huge amount considering. I suppose sample return from Moho would be would be impressive. So. That's that one. Let's see what else we've got. Where's our, where's our other craft at? It should be, uh, there we are. I see you. There we go. We're going to switch to you. So that's the great trog, Trogs craft. And now we're going to pull these two into orbit today. And then we're going to try and land. This is actually the aim. This is the, the plan. Now this has got a much beefier stage. Ah, now I'm trying to remember. Does this, this stays in orbit, doesn't it? It stays in orbit, acts as a relay. And then this thing goes down to land, but we don't need to worry about that just yet. We just need to get this thing into into orbit, right? So let's have a look. Um, we're gonna we're gonna warp to here first of all. So one of the things I want to do is I want to check actually. Um, that's is that the what stage is that? We got another stage. Well, we do. All right. So that's going to do the capture. These two combined. Um, the lander. The lander has 2,000 on it. That must be more than enough. What has it actually got on board? It's got a lot of science equipment, actually. That's really nice. We want to we get some of that going on. Get some of that science going on as much. It's only got one bio sample, hasn't it? So that's going to be the landed one. So I think we go for landing with this first. Because if it works, we can use... I suppose it, it doesn't matter. We could use the other one as a on its way down, couldn't we? Or vice versa. Yeah, it would have been nice if this had actually had another another sensor on it, um, but it does not. So we we can't. We, you just work with what you've got, sea monsters. Work with what you've got. What's going on here? How far away are we? Um, oh, this is a much closer one, isn't it? I forgot about that. Right, so we're going to warp through there. So this should pull us in. Yeah, there we go. This is a much tighter. Um, can I can I can I get into more? Can I? I want to show me more. I want I want to focus on more. There we go. Right. So we're going to do a capture here, like so. And this is going to be a, a tight-ish capture, isn't it? I don't, this one, ironically, would have probably been better being a looser capture because of the fact it's using a, a thing to signal back. Now, this one does not have a relay, if I remember rightly. Um, we could go for the pole on this one. Yeah, actually, that's an idea. We could we could put it in this orbit. Then we could actually get the, the probe. To increase its 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 orbit from the north, uh, yeah, that's not a bad idea. And then have it just hang down here for longer, and then we can choose our landing time. That would probably be a good idea. Yeah, I like that. All right, so this is going to be uh, yeah enough. We're going to have enough for this. So that's good. Right now, as we're coming in, what I'm actually going to do is stop that. We're going to uh, see what science can we get that we don't already have. We have this thing on here, so we're going to run that. Uh, check the old solar panels. We have another set there that I can actually pull out, can't I? Uh, we'll transmit that. Thank you very much. Um, now I need to make sure that this is set to um, partial. And I want these to be set to partial and partial. Oh, we're out of battery power. Okay. Note to self. Remember that the uh, mag, mag spec doodle what's it thingy is an absolute nightmare for electric power. Maybe we should, uh, I don't want to pull unfurl those just yet. I'm going to unfurl one. 
because I have a thing about solar panels. I have a thing about solar panels when you're about to de disconnect craft from each other. It always goes wrong. All right. Um, so this one needs to be, let's have a look. This needs to be uh, allow partial. Is that correct? And that's required. We allow partial. One transmission interruptions may enter. Yeah, okay, that's fine. All right. So we're going to fast forward there. I don't think there's any other science to get, is there? I don't think we've got any other science that we would want to get. I mean, uh, we've got all of these, haven't we? Got log that. That's already done. We're not doing a return to curbing, so that's not going to be an issue. That's done. And we've got the bio sample on the other side. We've got a thing there. Okay. Right. So this thing, we can, we can time warp in now. And we've got, what, nine minutes left. How exciting. We might actually try and get a landing in, in or partway through a landing in this thing. This one's going to be an interesting one because <clears throat> instead of going for a longer range antenna on this, it is a two-part, which I quite like. I quite like the concept. It's very much like what, um, was it the Cassini Huygens and things like that, where you've got the, the things, you, a lot of the Mars missions are sort of like that. Um, we're going to put this into a retrograde. It's going to take a while to roll around, actually, isn't it? It's got about four seconds. Um, so the signal we are we're sending it back to Kerbin. Okay, it's direct, is it? Yeah, we've got direct connection. Probe controls full. The twelve percent signal. So Moho is on the brink of that antenna, which is interesting. That's a small one, isn't it? Um, all right, thirty seconds. Now this one should have a bit more kick because these are bigger engines. Which engine is this? Is this a poodle? Yeah. So we've got two poodles. Yeah, double poodle. It's very much my style, actually, double poodling. In fact, is this my is this my design? This might actually be. I can't remember one of the. Did one of these have? A, did both of these have a launch craft with them, or did I have to build one? I can't remember. All right, we'll we'll we'll, we'll figure that out anyway. Uh, right there, we are. Fire fire the engines. Give us full full thrust, and uh, we're going to pull this down into orbit. Hopefully, what I am going to do is we're going to actually just let it just 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 there. Right there, we go. And then I want to uh, timey wimey warp it a bit. We're going to use up all that fuel. Right. Uh, we can go a bit faster, actually. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. And then just before we do a stage, we'll drop the, the speed down a little bit because I always get a bit paranoid about the wobble factor. Right. And then we're going to. There we go. You see that? See the wobbling there as the pressure kicks in? Uh, where, where? Why are we spinning around? Oh, because we're going over the surface right now. Okay. Um, so are we, oh, because that's Paul. Oh, now we could go Moho with Moho with this. Is this like, I think that's the Moho, but equally it could be in there somewhere. I'll have to go and do some reading about the Moho and such, but uh, it is something I've never visited and I would like to visit. Um, I suppose I should get ready to, to cut the engines on this one. Um, there we go, dude, that's close enough for me. Right. So let's have a look. Which one do we want to do first? What do we want to do first? Um, yeah, this is a problem actually. Yeah. How long does that engine take to go? It's got very good thrust, two times speed. We're currently going at the orbital speed around Moho is not high. So I could actually just skim it right down, but then the lower I skim it, the more chance I'm not going to have signal. Um, let's go with the Jimmy first. Yeah, we'll go, go with Jimmy's craft first because this is the easier, potentially the easier one. So if this one makes it to the surface, we can use the other one's uh, bio sample on the way down or vice versa. Right. So where do I want to land? Um, well, first of all, let's come to here. Yeah, let's warp to there. But 175 days until the next thing. Oh, right. So this is going to come here. Okay. It's going around in this direction. I thought it was going the other direction. We just caught anyway. Oh, we got signal back there. That's nice. So that that is going to act as a little relay if need be. So what I want to do is I want to put my periaps near near there. So we're going to put retrograde on. Of course, we're going to start losing. Oh, we've got the solar panel on the bottom now as well for this one, which is really nice. All right, so I want to, I want to drop it. Now, what's the thrust on this? Actually, you just remembered. 1.5. It is not the best thrust in the world, is it? Um, I'm going to skim it. We're going to skim over the surface about there. Yeah, that's that's nice. I like that. Right. So let's come into about here. Right. So this is going to be an interesting one because I have no idea what this is going to be like to land, actually. Um, oh, there we go. Mr. Goobs have sons. We've got 10 science. 
Have I finished that mission? Oh, we have. We finished it. That's great. Wonderful. So what happened there then? So something, obviously there's like a, a comet or a meteorite has just hit it. Um, it seemed to be quite, quite big. Right. So we're going to be in retrograde now. Do I just go for this? I think, I think I have to, don't I? I can see this going wrong. Jimmy, I apologize now uh, for what is about to happen. Uh, put that on there. How It's not that spiky, is it? Mm. Fire the engines. Fire everything. We're coming, we're coming out. Right. Okay. Get this. I don't want that. Right. Um, kill up. Where are we? 5k. Right, we're going to put it. This is, this is going to be annoying because I'm going to have to really. What I should go is to the periaps there. Is that actually above the hills, first of all? I don't think we're going to hit anything. I think we should go there. We should actually then bring our orbit down on the other side because it's just, it's just more, it's just more, it's more than we need, actually. I, I'm aware of the thrust on these engines not being great. 1.6 is not brilliant for a landing. I, I like a nice high, high energy, but then I suppose, you know, hover slamming is the, you know, it is bumpy, isn't it? God, I can't remember when the last time I was, I went past Moho. So this is, a, this is a brand new experience, with not brand new experience. It's a, it's been a while experience. Oh, I can't go any faster. Wait, you know what? We're just going to land then. Because, um, yeah, I'm, I can't be bothered waiting now. Um, so we'll do this. What's my um, what's my periaps dropping at? 60 kilometers. Okay, we are we are doing stuff. I can always do a, a radial out if I need to pull us up a bit and give us some more time. But we'll see. So we're going to be... So about four minutes away, that should be enough. And the good thing about this thing is that, um, oh, we're going up. Oh, because we're going over things. What's he, what's he realistically saying that? Okay. Um, this is going to take a while to just burn off, isn't it? Um, let's, let's get a bit of speed on, I think. There we go. While we're doing this now, let's have a look. What are we, what are we looking at? We're about four kilometers up. I've got a lot to do still. Um, I may, if we get too low. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna pop it. Um, right, I'm going to do that a bit. That's what I want to do. I want to just pull us up a bit. Yeah, it's not the most efficient way of doing it, but you can see that we want to try and bring bring this on a bit more and and get a bit a bit of there. about there about there is where I want to be uh, because that is I think. That is going to be a problem. Yep, yeah, that is going to be a problem. Um, I think we're lower than the actual mountains. I've got a horrible feeling we are lower than the mountains. Let's have a look. Uh, possibly, possibly lower than the mountains. Um, it's going to be tight. It's going to be very tight. Okay, no, no, we're going over the top of them. Okay, just, 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 just. Right. Uh, now put me in retrograde. Give me full retrograde. Right. <clears throat> so we're now down to 300 meters per second. So we're, we're slowing. We're getting... What's our thrust to weight now? We're at 1.9. We are we're actually going up a bit, aren't we? We've got a bit of a, we've got a bit of time now. That's good. We like that. Um, that's a nice peak there, isn't it? I hope we don't come in now. We're going to be fine. We're going to be... So we're going to be aiming to land somewhere over here, probably. Uh, about 1,000 meters per second left in the tank extra. Got about a minute left on the burn. So you're probably going to see this. You're probably going to, might get to see the end of this. I don't know. We'll have to, have to play this around. Right. Uh, you know what? I think we need a bit more of that and that. Because we are coming in very, very fast right now. So I need to just lift it. Oh, I think this has not got the thrust I require. Come on, come on, put up, put up, put up, put up, put up, put up, 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 Are we going to land this in 25 seconds? We we might. 
We might land this in 25 seconds. We might. We might. There we go. And we're down. Oh, perfect. And the time is up. So from me until next time, have a great one.